Hi, I am Elise Villani from the Commonwealth Bank Southern Stars and I'm back for blog number two. Now, often we get asked questions, what do you do on your rest days? Now, although we don't have many, today's been a travel day and it is a rest day and I would like to give you a little sneak peek into someone's hidden talent. So, let's have a look into room 226. And who do we have here? Welcome to the Honey Salon. This is Alex. Alex Blackwell at the Honey Salon. Come in. Let's go see. Welcome to the Salon of the Honey. So we have the beautician here, Alex Blackwell. Hi there. How are you? I'm good, thank you. And um, can you tell me who your patient is today? Well, I have a returning customer customer in Rachel Haynes. Um, I know you've already enjoyed my services have, a few yeah. times. Um, look, I only do arms, waxing of the arms, and um, the feedback so far has been pretty good. So um, just the arms. Why Why have you just gone the arms? There's, there's no legs, there's, there's nothing else, um, just, just one sort of product happening here. I just like to focus on one area and get it really well done. So I'm, I'm very experienced now in the arms. Perhaps we can progress on another tour. Okay. And Rachel, how many times have you um, experienced this um, treatment from Alex? Well, as Al said, I am a returning customer. So I think this is probably my fifth visit. I generally try and get to, to Al Salon once a tour. Once a tour. So, Alex, how did this come about? When did this um, when did this start becoming a bit of a tradition? Well, actually, it was in the West Indies, and it was Rachel that started the tradition. She likes to use the pre uh, waxed strips, whereas I prefer to use the hot wax in application. I feel like you get a better result. Also, it's quite soothing as <laughs> um, the application process and the removal, um, and it can be quite entertaining if you. Watch this. Uh, you'll see that Rachel tenses up a little bit because I have hit her in the past. Oh, lovely. Now, can we can we zoom in on that? How many hairs did we get, do we think? That Is that a good, good one? That's yeah, a pretty good one. Rachel, you think that's good? Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, lovely. And so you do reuse these strips. Is, is that right? Well, yes. When we get a bit short on the strips, because this is uh, water-soluble wax, so you can just <laughs> rinse it right out and then dry the uh, strips with the hairdryer. So you have to be quite resourceful in the in the um, in the hotel rooms because we don't have a microwave. So I'm using a kettle to boil water, submerging the pot, and uh, getting the the heat that way. Lovely. Now, Alex, what else does this salon provide? What are the little special features someone can expect to to? Oh, there we go again. That was good, right? Yeah, that was good. One. What do the what do your um clients expect to um receive upon the well, salon treatment? I do like to pamper the clients, so I <laughs> like to remove the excess wax, let them relax, and I'll just get that right off. And then once that's removed, I like to finish with <laughs> jojoba oil. <laughs> it's nice for dry skin, which Rachel has an issue with dry skin. So I know this. Being a returning client, I, uh, I know that she has troubles with sunscreen. that. So. Oh, it's a, yes, so just it is the sunscreen. a bit of oil to finish, perhaps a little hand massage. This has never happened before. And that's done. <laughs> and um, what product do you like using and why? Maybe we could get an endorsement. Well, look, I, I find Veet the best. Um, I have tried other products, but yeah, definitely Veet. Well, you've heard it here first, guys. Veet works well. And if you'd like a wax, come on tour with the Southern Stars.